I mentioned Volvo Penta's EVC control and this is the control here. I'll point out the features. Tilt and trim button, so obviously down and up. On the back side we've got a lock so you can't move it in and out of gear without pulling that up. But once it's up, it'll go in and out of gear. Now we've got a little button here that allows you to select neutral only. So that allows you to press that button just like that and that gives you a throttle only so that you can warm the engine up. Down at the bottom we've got trim assist. If we activate the trim assist, it basically means that you don't have to play with this trim control while you're driving the boat. So you can program it and set it up to best suit your boat with the way you load it. We have cruise control. If you activate the cruise control, you've got two buttons here, one for faster, one for slower. So if you just want to change the RPM by 50, which is often desirable in heavy weather, without having to grab the stick, you can just hit the button, plus or minus. Down at the bottom here we've got tow mode. That feature is particularly designed for ski boats, I would say, or water sports. You can program the engine to go to a certain RPM, so when you hit the throttle, she'll go straight up to that preset RPM, which means that your, uh, the person that you're towing is not going to end up going five mile faster than he wants to and falling off his water ski. The final feature here is the safety lanyard. Most of us would have uh, seen these before. Hook that round your wrist. If you go overboard, the engine shuts down and can't be restarted until the safety lanyard has been uh, reinstalled. Great safety feature. Obviously, it's got starting gear protection, so once the gears are engaged, you can't start the engine until you pull it back to neutral. Great safety feature.